some Federal Hill business owners are hoping to bring in more visitors and money by rebranding the restaurant district. Eyewitness News reporter Rosie Woods joins us from the control room with more on the proposal new at 530. Well, the association tells me they've already raised $10,000 and they're getting a lot of positive feedback on their branding idea to call Federal Hill Little Italy. Do we want the parking meters or don't we? Is it hurting your business? Federal Hill business owners say they're fed up with the status quo and looking for new ways to bring business and cash into their community. Downtown in this part of the city is exploding. Why not? After an emergency meeting Tuesday to discuss recent crime, the Federal Hill Commerce Association is focused on rebranding the district as Little Italy. And I know some people in this room want to say Federal Hill. Unfortunately, only Rhode Islanders know the hill as the hill. In just two days, the group has already raised $10,000 for signs and decorative lights. Let's start expanding. Let's expand with Broadway. Broadway is becoming an economic engine. There's thousands of businesses there. We're not tapping in. I've been saying this for 25 years. And the ideas don't stop there. Gianfranco Morocco, the owner of Hotel Dolce Villa, has suggested meeting with city and state officials to get highway signs. I want to put signs on the highway, 95 North, 95 South, which has 110,000 cars a day go through, and on Route 6 and 10 connectors. They simply say, next exit, Little Italy. But there's still one thing this community says they need to get rid of. We don't want parking meters. Now the entire state, oh, we go to the hill, we have to pay the park. Why would they come here? The association also tells me they do plan to meet with the community again to make sure the majority of people are on board with these ideas. In the control room, Rosie Woods, Eyewitness News.